Hi Virgo, welcome to my third channel, my Virgo only channel. My name is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I post every day bringing you the latest updated tarot reading. In this reading, we're going to find out who has been spying on you and why. Today is the 29th of December 2023. Time here in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia is 9.53 p.m. Okay, Virgo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo. Who has been spying on Virgo and why? And I'm going to go slow on shuffling because <laughs> I burned my fingers. <laughs> was all my fault though. Um, ooh, okay. Very strong fire energy, Virgo. Page of Pentacles and what verse at the bottom of the deck? Okay, Virgo. It's these three fingers because I touched the stove and it was still hot. But anyway, Virgo, we've got the Page of Wands, strong fire energy. This person is a fire sign, could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. But I see all the signs here, or unless you have one, two, three, four, five people spying on you. We've got the Page of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Virgo, Capcom, Taurus. Another Virgo, Capcom, Taurus. Oh, wait a minute. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, maybe you have six people spying on you, okay, Virgo. <laughs> but you've got a main actor right here. Doesn't matter, he or she, not gender specific. Um, this person has been spying on you because I think they're disappointed and sad about something. Okay, five of cups. Either something has happened between two of you, um, some issues, or maybe it could be separated. Maybe both of you could be separated because ten of cups here is in one first. That means there's trouble in paradise or again, it could, it could mean that both of you are separated. Ace of Cups is right next to the Ten of Cups and first. Ace of Cups, I think this person could be spying on you because they love you. They care about you. They have feelings for you. They're passionate about you. And they're feeling really King of Cups here and all first. Um, emotionally unstable, sad, thinking a lot about you, stressing out about you. Hmm. Virgo, aren't you popular? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six people. And it feels like these six people, mm, hmm. if Virgo, you're currently dealing with someone, okay, romantically, and I feel maybe it's still new. Yeah, it could it could be indica it could be an indication of a new connection because Paige is young and Ace is a new beginning. Ten of Cups are on first, perhaps. Don't know yet where the future, you know, what's going to happen in the future be between two of you because the connection is still too new. You have that one person whom could be spying on you, okay? Because maybe this person just wants to get to know you better, wants to know more about you. Um, but also at the same time, the Five of Cups, maybe they're, they're regretful over something they have said because Paige is a messenger or that they wonder, like, did I say the right thing? So Virgo, is Virgo interested in me? It's almost like this overthinking energy, right? Nine of Swords. I definitely would say that this person is um, very, very attracted to you, okay? Fire energy, very passionate about you. Um, and we've also got the Nine of Wands, Page of Cups. And if there's another person here, Virgo, um, whatever the case is, there's only one Ace of Cups right here. So it feels like all of these people who whom could be spying on you right now, they love you, they care about you, they could be overthinking about something, okay? Again, the second person would be somebody you're separated from, okay? You've got one, at least one new person. You're currently connected to someone whom could be spying on you and you may also have 
somebody you're separated from, going through some issues with. All of these are male, fe uh, masculine energy, okay? But we've also got a feminine energy here with the Empress. I forgot this is you. I always read the Empress as you. Empress has come out a lot in a lot of your readings. And I feel like Virgo, you're beautiful, okay? These people could be spying on you because just because you're beautiful, you're giving, you're kind, you have a lot of things going on for you, a lot of great qualities. Because the Empress, I always talk about how the Empress sits at the highest position. So um, perhaps these people admire you, look up to you. Hmm. There's definitely one person who feels rejected here, who could be spying on you, may have rejected this person in the past. Oh my god. Can we not have any more people coming out <laughs> in your reading? King of Wands. Aren't you popular, Virgo? Three of Pentacles in the first. Here we go again. There's one more person here. Queen of Cups in the first. Okay, the Queen of Cups in reverse is a feminine energy. Now, there's doesn't matter, feminine, masculine, we have both, okay? We have both. I can be a female, but embodying more of a masculine energy, and it constantly changes, shifts, but just say what resonates with you, okay? Now, the Queen of Cups, if this is you, Queen of Cups here in reverse can indicate maybe this is, these are the people that, whom either have rejected you or you you may have rejected them you may have felt also kind of sad in regards to how things pan out between the two of you now king of wands you know the most interesting part of this spread is all of these people except for the queen of cups which i, sus I suspect could be you okay unless it's another feminine energy a friend a female friend um whom could be sad um, because you don't want to be their friends any, this, with this, be this person's friend anymore. Three of Pentacles in reverse, or it could be a family member, because Ten of Cups here is in reverse. But I feel like at one point in time, you and this person were happy together, um, were close, okay? There's one person you're close with, you were close with, could be a friend or could be a family member who could be spying on you, okay? But I, again, I feel like the connection between you and this person either has been severed or that there have been some misunderstanding, um, some misunderstandings in the past, okay, or lately, or lately, a third person goes on and just not get along, disagreeing about something, okay. That's like that one friendly energy, a friend energy, or could be, again, a family member, okay. But Virgo, what's interesting about this spread is all the masculine energy is in the upright position, except for the Page of Pentacles. Now you already have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. You already have like nine people right here on your spread. So, hey, where do I start since there are so many people? So it could just be Virgo, some of you, you are popular, okay? You are popular. People want to get to know you, want to learn something about you, want to see what's going on with you. You know, spying could also be just, hey, you know, I want to see what Virgo is posting today because I'm a big fan, because I admire Virgo, because Virgo is an empress. Virgo is either beautiful or has so much going on or just somebody really, really popular, okay, Virgo? So for those popular Virgos, you do have like so many people just spying on you, wanting to see what you're up to every single day, or even if some of you, if you're an influencer, it doesn't matter if you're an influencer or not, or a YouTuber, um, or that you're just beautiful. There are, you know, these days, if you look at Instagram, Facebook, people have so many friends, so many followers, whether you are an influencer or not. Like even the, the, if, you have, if you have 100 people following you, well, it makes sense to have all of these people spying on you. Spying on you, you know, it may not be a bad thing. I don't see it as a bad thing, to be honest. But the strongest energy that I'm picking up on, Virgo, is this one person who has been spying on you, but also may be feeling very sad at the same time, okay? Someone who may have disappointed you in the past, or they may, or vice versa. Now, we've got the king and the queen. 
of cups and lovers. So this indicates to me, Virgo, you've had a romantic relationship that, with this one particular person. Okay, there's most likely there is a separation or both of you are either not talking to each other right now or not really actively connecting to each other. Some sort of a separation, going through some issues, could be any of those things. Okay, this person has been spying on you because they still care, they still love you. Um, and the Knight of Swords, they think about you a lot. And the Knight of Swords is at night, you know, sleeping. So maybe also, it can indicate nightmares. This person may have had nightmares. They may have dream of, dream of you. I mean, it happens a lot to us when you dream of somebody and then the next day we think about that person and then we try to check up on their social media if they have social media. So it could be that scenario. That's what I'm seeing right here. But, you know, look at the Five of Cups. So, for God, this person is sad, right? Most likely, I feel like both of you are kind of separated. And another thing that I'm seeing here, because the, there is a bit of a distance energy I'm picking up on here, because this page and the Three of Wands, these two cards, actually, the moment the Page of Wands came out, I already felt that distance, okay, Virgo? So you may have somebody at a distance from you are, Maybe it's a long distance connection if you're actively connecting with someone, whether you're separated or not, or still together. But there is a, this very, like a distance energy. So somebody from afar could be spying on you currently because this person is interested in you, right? King of Wands, passionate about you. Maybe these three are connected because these three are fire signs, okay? And maybe this Page of Pentacles and the, um, King of Pentacles are connected because these two are Earth elements and the Page of Cups could be connected to the King of Cups because these two are water elements, right? Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Okay, now, so if the fire signs are connected to each other, it belongs to one person. I would say you have at least one person who is crazy about you, passionate about you, finds you to be, you know, um, super attractive, not just attractiveness, it's like the beauty, you know, the empress, I wouldn't call her attractive. I usually see the empress as more like absolutely beautiful, you know, somebody who has everything going on for them, um, somebody very motherly, okay, it doesn't matter he or she or fatherly if you're a male, somebody who um, is very wholesome and also somebody who is almost perfect. Um, has everything, like a full package, definitely a full package, the Empress here. So you have at least one person who desires you so much because this person thinks that you have like a full package, okay? Whether you, you, you feel that way or not, doesn't matter, okay? It's how this person perceives you to be. And, but, Three of Pentacles here is in reverse, Page of Pentacles and Three of Wands. Okay, so maybe Virgo, this is somebody who desires you so much and you're not really paying them any attention. Okay, maybe you're replying to the messages late or you're not talking to them, you're not reciprocating much. Page of Pentacles in reverse. You know, page, pages are messengers, so it may be related to certain messages or communication. Um, Maybe you're not really reciprocating, okay? Because now the pentacle is also your element, which is earth, and right next to it is the fire. Now the page pentacles is in reverse, so that means this is you. Maybe you are not talking to them because this is upside down while this is in an upright. Their, face, their faces are not facing each other, so that means it can indicate, <clears throat> excuse me, um, communication that is in stable or the communication that isn't uh, reciprocative, okay, if that's even the right way of saying it, like, it's not reciprocate, yeah, it's not reciprocative, like, it's as though they write you something or they suggest something to you, you're not really, it could be either you're not replying to this person on time or you're not replying at all, or that they could be suggesting something to you to meet up, whatever, and you may say no or give a lot of excuses could be any any anything like that okay um it just is, it just doesn't feel like it's the same the energy is not the same okay it's not balanced three of wands here is a reverse maybe there's someone you kind of like 
you know, <laughs> um, ignoring or turn your back on. Um, and Eight of Swords here is in love first. Some of you, you aren't really even thinking about this person, okay? You're just busy being the empress that you are, you know, doing whatever. Um, what, anything that you're prioritizing and, and understanding maybe your worth and your value. And there could be some valid reasons, Virgo, why you're not really reciprocating to this person's advances or messages. Um, see you ignoring them. And I guess that raises your value in some way, shape, or form. Again, the Empress sits at a very high position, at the highest position. So you may value yourself so much that you're not actually paying attention to this person. I hope that makes sense. Yeah. Now this is king, right? This is a king. This is a knight. This is a page. And the empress is higher than all these three here. So maybe this person respects you. This person wants you so bad, so badly or wants to connect with you so badly because you have something that they don't have or that you have more than then, then they do. Now, the the fire energy definitely are more of a chaser. Okay, somebody who chases, um, because fire is, you know, passionate, and um, the empress is literally sitting down, just pretty. Um, it's like, you come to me, that kind of energy. I'm not going to you. You come to me, and even this one, the knight of wands is sitting on a horse and the horse especially the fire horse <clears throat> it moves definitely faster than the other horses um the fire to me the fire horse and the air horse which is a knight of swords move faster than the two other horses which is the cup i'm like teaching instead of reading <laughs> feel like I'm teaching but no anyway this is a fast horse okay faster horse than the other knights except for the knight of uh, knight of swords but anyway because I used to be a teacher I used to teach so I've got that habit of teaching and explaining way too much but anyway we've got the page of cups right here another page now you got one two three pages um, again, it could be related to some sort of a communication. Um, maybe you're not really communicating with this this person in particular. Okay, eight of swords here is in reverse. Three of pentacles in reverse. For this energy of like, hey, you know, I'm sitting in my power. I'm sitting down. I'm sitting pretty. I'm beautiful. I've, you know, maybe for some of you, Virgo, you aren't even thinking about this person, or for some of you, aren't even like realizing or noticing how much this person wants you how much this person wants to be associated with you you know <laughs> so it makes me it, it actually makes me feel like these all these could just be them keep, keep trying and trying and trying right and here you are it's like nah not interested okay and for some of you maybe you were connected to this person in the past not all of you okay again you have so many people here just take what resonates with you messages might get crossed overlapped all, all, the, all of that um how do you say complicated stuff here now um virgo it makes the messages complicated so again just take what resonates okay we've got the united cups you could be see you could be this person's wish fulfillment. So this person could be spying on you because they wish to be with you. They wish to be associated with you. You are somebody whom they think is everything or almost everything that they want to be friends with or to be in a um, romantic connection with. We've got the four wands right here. This person wishes to be with you, yeah? I feel like it's more romantic than anything. Some of you, this could just be a friend, yeah? We already mentioned this one friend here whom I see. Maybe you and this person aren't really in good terms, yeah? This person could be spying on you. But we've got this one person whom actually wants to go to your house, be in your house, 
sleep with you or live with you, be in a relationship with you, establish some sort of a, a connection with you that is um, stable. Okay, see so many fire energy here, Virgo. Now this person could very much be a fire sign, okay, or has a lot of fire somewhere in a chart, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. And for all we know, all of these people, again, could belong to one person who actually wants to give you commitment here, right? Because the King of Pentacles gives commitment, like is a committed, committed king. So maybe this person wants to commit to you. And then with Five of Cups here, could be disappointed because, you know, you maybe you don't want to be com Either you don't want this person or you don't even know that this person exists, okay? Or, and again, Virgo, it could be you, these two, queen and a king, both in reverse, could also be just this one person whom you separated from in the past. Now, the Ace of Cups, for some of you, Virgo, this, uh, you know, I always read the Ace of, not always, sometimes as like self-love and self-care. So with the Empress here, it just further, further, Sorry, my tongue is also burned. Oh my gosh, I'm burned everywhere. <laughs> my fingers, my tongue, because <laughs> I drink hot coffee. But anyway, so the I'm person of cups, the ace of cups, it's like you, Virgo, maybe you have been um, showcasing yourself, okay, in a way where you are loving yourself more. It could be, again, Virgo, you just working out or looking beautiful, looking... You look also, I'm hearing this word right now, you look fulfilled, okay? You look fulfilled. It's almost like, because when the cup is upright in an upright position, that means the cup is filled with water. And it's not just filled, but it's overpouring. <laughs> It's it's more. It's more than that. So something, Virgo, I feel like there's one person here at least who's spying on you. But you, you definitely have multiple people spying on you, okay? Ace of Cups, you could be doing so well for yourself or looking so good, okay? You may have Ace is a new beginning, something new you have done to yourself. Could just be your new vibe, your, uh, your new vibe, your energy, okay? Um, that's attracting a lot of these people and also it could be someone you separated from which again that that person's energy is pretty strong here Virgo this person maybe could be realizing that they love you or love you more fallen in love with you it feels like there's a new sense of love a new romantic feelings if they've loved you before they're gonna love you more they've re maybe lately they started love you more or if this is someone very new, they find themselves starting to have some romantic feelings for you. Or, you know, someone who has loved you and cared about you, but now really deeply falling in love with you, right? Now it's like the Nine of Swords, look at this. Oh my God. It's like, oh my God, what have I done? Why do I feel this way for Virgo? And it's, it's, it feels like it's a good thing, but it's also like not such a good thing, Five of Cups, because that makes this person feel very vulnerable, right? King of Cups here in reverse. Seven of Wands in reverse. But the thing is, Virgo, what I love about the spread is you, again, just sitting there in, in, in your power, just beautiful, knowing your worth and your value, and you're like attracting all of these people to you, wanting to know what what you're up to, wanting to see what you're doing, wanting to see your pictures, or wanting to talk to you, including including people, not just new people, there are new people here, but also people who, uh, people from your past, people you've connected with, on a romantic level and also could be on a uh, friendship level even familial familial level like as in family okay it could be a family member anybody but Virgo what can I say you have so many people here um, interested okay interested you have one person who is truly Google Gaga over you <laughs> 
<laughs> haven't used that word Google Gaga in a long time. Google Gaga over you for once. You know, imagining all sorts of possibilities being with you. But I still see it not being like I think this person will be spying on you because they don't know if you feel the same way for them or if you're interested or not. Um, because you're minding your own business, right, Virgo? Even if you do communicate with this person, um, there's one here who is Google Gaga over you. Uh, even when, even if you do connect with them, you do talk to them, they they could be spying on you because they don't. They, you don't come off desperate because see the two threes here are in reverse. That means maybe you're ignoring them. Maybe you're not just like reciprocating um, as much as they like you to reciprocate. Okay, Virgo, this is your reading. Hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings if you'd like to book me. Um, send me an email, okay? And also, unless if you want to catch me live during my live stream, um, on my other channel, it's Chelsea Love Tarot. That other channel um, is my main channel. And whenever I go live, I will do personal readings. Um, but you have to wait. It, it's definitely way more affordable than, you know, booking a personal, like a private reading with me. Um, but anyway, anyway, if you're interested, there's so many options, okay? Everything is in the description box below. You can also book me for like a video call, um, video call reading, but that's like quite pricey as well. So, but anyway, all the options are out in the open. You can pick and choose if you're interested. Okay, Virgo. And don't forget to also hit on the bell notification button. Um, so you'll be notified every time I post your videos. And yay, New Year 2024. Happy 2024. Happy New Year, Virgo. Um, I hope to see you back here again sooner than later. Love you. Bye.